Good evening everyone. The professional bull riders were one of the first to put fans back in the stands this past weekend. A difficult task to say the least, but the organization believes they have a good grip on it moving forward. It was an unusual sight in these strangest of times. We can create one memorable experience for one fan in that, in that arena, we won. Fans in the stands for a live sporting event. Thankful all the fans right here today. Your support is very important for us. Everybody uh, felt that it was a glowing success and we felt that it's an event that we can build upon and take this model to other cities. After months of preparation, the PBR putting together a comprehensive plan at the Danny Sanford Premier Center to make the Sioux Falls Invitational possible. We've looked at everything from how we park cars at respective venues, to how they enter the venues, to how they receive their tickets, to where they sit inside the pod model that we created. Nearly 6,000 fans taking part over the three days, socially distanced, sitting in pods, with all the necessary health checks coming in, and no reported COVID-19 cases coming out. From a live event perspective, we're looking at this as driveway plus three. And what that means is we look at three days prior to the event and we're looking at three days after the event and, and, and building our plan to a, a address all of those. Now the question becomes, can they keep bucking this trend that is sweeping our nation? We learned some things coming out of Sioux Falls that we're going to put into place for Bismarck. I'm pretty sure we're going to learn some things out of Bismarck that we're going to put in place uh, for the next stop, which would be Salt Lake. As the tour hits the second half of their season restart. We're doing it the best way we know how, the cowboy way. We're just going to put our head down, we're going to keep working, and, and we're going to try to do what's right for our fellow humans. That's the cowboy way.